Hi guys, it's Maka Pussy here and we're back with another song reaction and today we are doing the song Where Did All The Time Go? by Dr. Dog. I have been assured there's a serious band, but their name's dreadful. <laughs> it doesn't instill me with hope, but we're going to go in, we're going to listen to it. Hey, I have been surprised before, right? I'm going to go in, I'm going to check it out. I'm going to be the open-hearted, generous fucking guy that uses a vodka game to know and put up with. I'm going to see if uh, is it any good. This is, this is straight off the soundtrack to an indie fucking rom-com. I would not be surprised if this was on the 500 Days of Summer soundtrack. <laughs> but also, that's kind of my bag. I quite like those songs. It feels very kind of The Shins, kind of Matt DeMarco, that area of music. When those guys get that shit right, I'm all for it. So, let's go. So far, I'm really liking instrumentals. I like how kind of lo-fi it all sounds. Th that gives me hope for my album. You know what it sounds like? It sounds like a more accessible early Grizzly Bear, before Grizzly Bear actually was able to get good production on, on their albums. Starting to fly. It's just reminding me of so many bands that I'd, that I'd completely forgot about that I really liked. Like fucking Edward Sharp and the Magnetic Zeros, Haha ha Tonka, just a whole bunch of shit from like the early 2000s American indie scene that was really, really good. But I then just moved away from and completely forgot that they existed. <laughs> She gets dressed up like a pillow, so she's always in bed. Flowers for the sick and dead. She's on the go, way too fast and way too slow. She'll turn the stone, and has my voice and two holes. And when the fall rises, somebody sighs who is not in disguise right here's what i really like about this kind of music it's happy and uplifting but at the same time also really really sad and it de really depends on what mood you're in when you go into that music what you're going to get away from it that could be uplifting but it could also be absolutely fucking miserable the only differentiating factor is how you feel at the time a song that can access any mood is universal <laughs> Starts 
Okay. How did I miss that band? <laughs> when I was going through my whole fucking Arcade Fire, Animal Collective, all that kind of things phase, how did I miss that band? No, I'm, I'm, to I'm totally listening to that album tonight. <laughs> it's kind it's kind of made me it's kind of made me want to watch Garden State. Guys, that was Dr. Dog with Weird All The Time Go. Let me know in the comments below. Did you like that song? Did you not like that song? I have been Mark Busey. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time.